Hey everyone, so usually I make videos about Brawl mods, but since someone asked me how to download Smash Universe, which was the most recent Brawl mod I covered, and I couldn't really find a good video to link to them, I decided to make a tutorial myself. Now you can also use this with other Brawl mods, however I'm just going to be using this with Smash Universe. If this tutorial helps you out, please like and subscribe. Anyway, let's get into the tutorial. So the first thing you're going to need is a Brawl ISO. The second thing will be the mod that you want to download. I'm going to be using Smash Universe. Third thing will be Dolphin Emulator. I'm using this build right here. The fourth will be a Virtual SD Card Maker. The fifth will be Win Image. There might be another program you can use, however this is the one I am most familiar with. And the sixth thing is Gecko OS. All of these will be linked in the description. But I'm going to start off now by downloading Gecko. There it is. I already downloaded it twice. So now once you have Gecko on your desktop, you can double click it to open it up. And then you're going to close out of that. You're going to want to open your documents folder and go to Dolphin Emulator. Once you are in here, you're going to want to scroll down to Wii. Double click on that. And this is likely what it will look like except for this top folder here. So I'm just going to delete that folder. So, once you get Gecko, you're going to want to just drag that folder right in there. And you've basically just installed Gecko. Okay, so since I accidentally deleted the Smash Universe SD folder, I'm just going to be using this one, which I have no idea what mod this is. But it's the same process anyway. So next, you're going to open up the Virtual SD Card Maker. Windows, and then this right here, this top folder, or this top file, whoops. Okay, so here's the virtual SD card maker for Dolphin. Uh, with this right here, whatever this mod is, it's like 3 gigabytes big. With Smash Universe, for example, I think that's 5 gigabytes, so you'd probably need to press 8. However, I'm going to be pushing 7. So, um, I'm going to push three because I already have a virtual SD card in Dolphin right now which is Smash Universe. So I'm going to push three to create a new one and then you want to confirm the following. We're going to press Y to confirm. And it's going to take a little bit of time so we'll be back once this is done. Okay so I just finished working on this virtual SD card so it's done now. It says it can be mounted using M-Disk Virtual Disk Driver I didn't know that I could do that. I just downloaded WinImage, so that's what I'm going to be using. I'm just going to press X to exit. I'm going to open WinImage. So here is WinImage. I'm going to press File, and I'm going to locate to my SD card. Where is it? SD dot bra. There it is. Okay, so now that you've gotten your SD in here, you're going to want to take this folder right out. It's going to take probably a few minutes. Okay, so now that I've moved it to my desktop, I'm going to click Image and Inject a Folder. So now I'm going to browse my desktop until I see SD. So right here, you're going to want to click on this folder and click OK. Do you want to inject 6,923 files? Click Yes, and it will begin the injection. Okay, so I actually had to go up to an 8 gigabyte SD card because this was bigger than 3 gigabytes. It was like 5 gigabytes, actually. However, I have now put everything onto this SD card. So now what you're going to want to do is save. Okay, so now you're going to want to drag the SD card from your desktop or wherever you saved it into the Wii folder. Okay, so once you open Dolphin up, you're going to want to right click on this and set that as the default ISO. You're going to want to go into config, Wii, and have insert SD card enabled. By the way, if you do want to have the game look great, you can enable the widescreen hack, upscale the revolution, resolution, and do some other stuff here. So now you're going to want to click open, and navigate to Wii, or Dolphin Emulator, Wii, Gecko, Gecko, HPC, Gecko, boot.elf, and click open. So now you'll see this, you're going to push X or A, whatever controller you're using and as you can see it worked because the mod is right here if we push X because I'm using my keyboard right now as you can see it should load in to the 
game. Here we go. So Brawl and the... And I... Oh, I have the old version of the mod because that's the version I had on that SD card. Or on that SD.zip folder. Okay everyone, so that is how you get Brawl mods on Dolphin. If you enjoyed, or if this helps you, just please like and subscribe. Comment anything else you'd like to see below. Anything helps. Thanks.